what's up you guys thank you so much for joining me again for another video today's video is a planning video and if you saw the title then you know what's going on so if you follow me for a little while you do know that i've been using the louis vuitton pm small ring agenda as my daily carry for about eight months now and I have to say that was a roller coaster. I bought it for a really great deal on Poshmark. I was really excited to use it. I used it again, like I said, for about eight months. And there are a few things that I loved about it, but I think I found myself day to day just having to justify to myself liking it. And the reason is the structure, the pocket configuration just was not doing it for me. So actually, let me cut back to what I mean before we continue unboxing my new daily carry, which is going to be the file packs Holborn. So yeah, here we go back to the LVPM. I actually already sold this on Poshmark. It sold super fast. Um, I love this little planner because it was so thin, which I hadn't seen before. I like a thin planner, even though I changed the rings to fit more. I still wanted it to be compact but i found myself really stressing out about stretching it like i like at the card slots they don't have much give and i would just find myself being really precious with it which is not something i like to do with my daily carries so i thought it was time to go back to trusty filofax i've had many many filofax planners in my time and um there's obviously a lot of variety to pick from but the leather ones are so flexible the leather ages so well it ages beautifully um it just it's a different planning experience and if you like planners then you might know what i mean i think the louis vuitton pm planner is you know it's nice if you only use it for to-do lists on the go and kind of like a wallet but I use my pocket planner for absolutely everything and I found myself being so frustrated with it not having pockets and I added you know those like little pockets like cash envelopes but then it was bulking it up and it was just not what I wanted. So again went back to Filofax super excited to unbox this Holborn planner. Look at the box first of all. Filofax always packages their planners so so well. Again here it comes like so protected nothing can harm this little guy and it's travels to me <laughs> so i got it in the deep brown it's almost like a chocolate color and it's coming off a bit darker on video almost black but it is the brown one and in person you can really see the chocolate brown color maybe you'll, you'll be able to tell once i remove the plastic but it's so pretty it's so compact and i think it will achieve everything that i've been looking for in my planning journey. I've tried so many planners and you know I learn every time what I like, what I don't like and you know I adjust and so I am hoping this will be the last adjustment for a while because I can see myself keeping this planner for a long time. So as you can see it is so soft. The leather is so so soft. It smells amazing too and the spine is still very thin which is very exciting to me. So once we open it up you will be able to see it better. It still has a lot of card slots, still works like a wallet. I would argue it works better like a wallet than the PM. And it is so flexible, so squishy. And again, I don't feel like I need to be precious with this planner. Not that I'm like throwing it in places, but I just don't want to be precious with it. Again, talking about the pockets, there's one on the side there, all of the card slots. There's another one inside behind the card slots. There's one more at the back. And there's another one by the pen loop that also has a tiny little zipper for coins or just like loose bits that you want to keep on you. Which again, so so practical. The pen loop has a stretchy material behind it, which is great. That was the difference with the Malden. If you know Filofax planners, you know that the Malden is another brown leather option, but the pen loops can be quite stiff. So this is me trying to fit my favorite pen because I am one of those people that cares very much about which pen they use and I'm in love with this pen. Um, and it fits, it's a little snug, but it does fit really well. So that made me very happy. And it also has the cash pocket in the back to yeah, store cash or receipts or anything like that. So again, very practical planner for a daily carry. And I think the LBPM was just not giving me that. It's also so beautiful. I love the soft leather. I love the contrast stitching. 
it feels really sturdy in your hands which is awesome again a note to not having to baby this planner and every Filofax planner comes with inserts ready to go for you to use them so this one um oh wait that this is another important thing the lvpm planner does not lay flat open and that really frustrated me it would always stick out like that and i would have to put something on top to keep it down and that just really annoyed me day to day whereas this one it's not laying fully flat yet because it's brand new but it will and i've seen a lot of videos about this planner it does end up laying flat and even like this it's still very decently flat so you can do a lot of planning you don't necessarily have to open the rings every single time and that was very important to me too so it comes with a weekend two pages inserts it also comes with this page marker slash ruler that's really beautiful really sturdy so i'm definitely going to be using that and then it comes with its own dividers filofax always includes these dividers um they're pretty they're fine they're good quality but i don't love having to use a key to remember what each number means so that's why i went ahead and i bought the nordfolk um divider set filofax has a lot of colorful dividers that i normally don't like but i think this set is so beautiful the colors complement each other really well and they complement the brown of a planner really well so i'm very excited to get those in there and then it also comes with your staple to-do list notes lined paper and that little envelope um in the back trying to close it with my pen and it does close and look it's still very thin very compact it still fits in absolutely every single bag that i have um, and I don't carry big bags, so again, this was very important to me that it was compact and thin. The spine is still very thin, similar to the LVPM, but just more practical for day-to-day -day use. Um, the LVPM comes with a 10mm ring set that I switched to another set for 16mm, and this one comes with a 15mm ring set. So still pretty much the same size as what I was using. Um, very squishy. So anyway, I'm just so so in love with this planner. Very excited to get into it. I will show you what it looks like when it's set up, but let me know your thoughts. See you soon!